If you go to the fall steeplechase this year, you may see something new. News Channel 6's Graham Lee with more on what's coming and what it means. Aiken Steeplechase has been around for almost a century, hosting thousands of horse racing spectators in recent years. And in just a few months, the track will have its first permanent structure. The new addition will be a finish line tower at the end of the racetrack, something that's been in the works for about a year. We, we knew that we needed this. Uh, at our previous property, we had a small tower that kind of grew over the years that was not big enough for our needs. So based on the knowledge of the past races and then looking at the property we have here, we started to think about what we wanted. And what they wanted was a three-story tower, which will improve the track in several different ways. The first floor is actually a place for uh, different functions like the weigh-in of the jockeys and whatever functions the National Steeplechase Association may have, so there will be some official functions there. The second floor is for the owner-trainer riders that gives them an opportunity to be above the crowd and see their horses race on the track. And then the third floor is for the NSA uh, governing functions, the, the people that watch and film the race. The project will cost about $300,000, which will primarily come from donors. The tower will also be named after one of the men contributing, lifelong horseman J.R. Stainbrook, who says there is plenty left in store for the property. Well, the thought was that um, it's the first one, so I thought it would start uh, uh, something going for other donors to step up, step up in, because we've got to put permanent barns in, they want to put the office here, and all of that, and so this is just the beginning. So somebody had to get the ball rolling, and I was happy to, to do it. It's a massive shot in the arm for tourism, for the restaurants, for hotels, and just every business in general in Aiken, so it's, it's a big part. And this will continue, it will grow that. The track president says the tower is expected to be completed by the end of the fall season, with the last race right here on Saturday, November 18th. In Aiken, Graham Lee, WJBF, News Channel 6.